All right, this should be pretty quick. Um, I came across this because I started looking about how to upgrade or update the firmware on a, an Olympus lens if you have a Panasonic camera body. So I have a Panasonic G9 II and I bought some Olympus lenses. It's OM system now. If you're not aware of that, I'm sure you already know that. But how to update firmware because I wanted to check the firmware on these lenses when I bought them. Um, you know, bought them from a you know a reseller and they're used. So then I start thinking about well how how can you update the firmware if you have a Panasonic body but a an Olympus lens? And I came across this website and I saw some other. Uh, let me just explain briefly what also led me to this. Uh, I saw some discussions on a Micro Four Thirds forum where somebody had tried to you know find a way to update the firmware and they ended up sending a lens you know Olympus lens to Olympus again it's OM system now uh, to have the firmware updated by them and it cost them like hundred forty dollars and I'm thinking well first of all you, you can go to eBay and buy a cheap um, Olympus EPM1 camera body those run about hundred twenty five dollars or so right now you know just to buy a body only just an old working Micro Four Thirds camera Olympus camera and then you can use that Olympus body um, with this app here, OM Workspace. You know, go to camera and then update. You know, so you'll have your camera connected. That's I don't know if the newer cameras they have Olympus OM system. If you can update the firmware like you do on a lot of other cameras, where you just basically put the the update file on an SD card and put it in the camera and update it that way. Um, but Olympus, in the past anyway, they had done it this way with this, their own software on the computer. You plug your com camera into the computer with a USB cable, and then you use this app to go and update the firmware. I don't really, you probably these days can do it through the, the, the app on a smartphone, but I, I um, don't have an Olympus camera new enough to do that. So anyway, back to this. So that's an, one option is to buy a cheap Olympus body. So if you're trying to update Olympus lenses, buy a cheap Olympus body on eBay that's working and then you can use that to update it. Or you can come here, um, I'll put these links in the, uh, the description down below, but what, basically what this is, Olympus has, or OM system, has these um, update files for all their Olympus lenses um, and then there's they give you a way to basically extract a file and download that, um, you download that file to computer, you extract the the file that's inside to be a bin file you put that that file on an SD card and then you put that in your Panasonic camera and with the Olympus lens attached to it and then you can update the firmware on the lens you know just like you would a Panasonic lens so for example if you um, have the um, Olympus um, 14 to, well let's say the 12 to 100 f4 so you click the link here and it opens up a new tab and then you know it'll tell you that it's downloading this file here it's an exe file but it's basically just kind of like a zip file um, and if you're a macintosh it will be a zip file but um, once you run this exe file on a windows computer it extracts this this bin file here and that's the file that you would put on your sd card and put that in your panasonic camera and update this olympus lens so that and then you just go through the normal update update process firmware update in in the camera's menus they also have uh, this other page, um, Joint Update Service for Interchangeable Lens Cameras, <clears throat> and it looks like there's a way to update uh, Panasonic lenses on Olympus bodies if you have the reverse situation where you have an Olympus camera body or OM system camera body, but you're using a Panasonic lens. Um, I haven't looked at the directions for this um, you know, to find out how you, how you do that, um, but you know, it has all this listed here. I'm sure there's directions on here. so. The whole idea of this video is just to kind of point you in the right direction if you're looking for a solution to do that. And I would always highly recommend updating the firmware on your lenses. Uh, anytime you buy a lens, whether it's used or new, uh, often you buy a brand new lens. It might have been sitting around for a little while, or it might just be, you know, only a few weeks from the factory, and all of a sudden a new firmware comes out to fix a bug, you know, with autofocusing or something. So you'd want to keep your firmware up to date on the camera and the lens. So there you go. Hopefully that's a uh, you know, useful to some people. And again, uh, you can either do it this way through their website, and it's really simple if you have a Panasonic body trying to update one of these Olympus lenses on the Panasonic body. It makes it really simple. I uh, just download that file, put it on the SD card. Um, 
but you can also, if you just happen to have, like I just happen to have an old Olympus EPM-1 camera body that I didn't, didn't get rid of because it wasn't any point in getting rid of it. It's so cheap, you know, wouldn't really be worth selling it. Um, but I, I can use that to update the uh, Olympus firmware on Olympus lenses um, using an Olympus camera and the OM Workspace app uh, on this computer. So anyway, hopefully that'll help you.